So <laughs> immediately just striking everything except Town and City. So next up, we're going to be, this is Ralphie versus Vivi. So I will say, Vivi is definitely one of those players who has feasted pretty well in kind of the, the twilight of Smash 4 for the most part. He's yeah. been getting consistently like top eight, you know, the fifth, fourth place range. Yeah, I think fourth place is his record. Uh, but yeah, no, Vivi's definitely like, he, he's he's been leveling up. And so hopefully he's able to carry that through into ultimate. Now, I'm not saying these two have been playing ultimate, but there may or may not have not been playing a lot of Smash 4 right now. So I'm expecting to see a, a fair amount of tech errors. They've been playing a lot of Project 5. Yeah, exactly. There we go. But we'll see, man. This matchup is still booty buns cheeks for Lucario, though. Yeah, I mean, Lucario is a character who has, like, difficulty with, like, basic neutral because, like, his normals are kind of... Bleh, yeah. Right. So then he doesn't really start playing the game until this percent anyway. So like, yeah, it's kind of counterintuitive the way that it works. And, and you also like don't want to play at 105 percent. Yeah. And you're like, gosh darn. Well, I, I guess here I am. <laughs> you know, when you have Cloud who's like macro spacing on you, just like covering all the space. You're like, oh, oh. Ugh. Yeah. And the thing that like makes Lucario really good is what a character like Cloud like doesn't let him get to do, which is hang around for a long amount of time, uh, you know, with with Aura and Rage. Oh, why? No, I swear he could have shot, headshot him right there. Yeah, I'm I don't think Ralphie sweet spot that. No, I yeah, didn't look like he did either. I'm curious why he didn't pull the trigger right away. Might be a little bit of muscle memory or something. Ooh, nice use of the force pod there. And now Aura Sphere is going to do that thing where it makes a really scary noise that makes it horrifying to approach it. Where it rips dimensions. <laughs> it's literally existing on multiple planes of existence. That nothing. There's a few things in this game that tilt me. Uh, that's like top three. That sound. Like, top three things that spook me from like horror is uh, the piano from Mario 64 <laughs> and Lucario's Aura Sphere over certain percents. <laughs> it's just, just you're like, oh god. We don't talk. We don't talk about the the, the thing from Mario 64. <laughs> nope. Or the sound of the hedgehog drowning music that like scared the crap out of me. <laughs> it starts off so loud. Da -da 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 -da. So Ralphie kind of finds himself in a world of hurt right here. But again, the beauty about Lucario is that hey, he, well maybe now he might be in danger of dying to something. Um, because the rage starts at uh, 50 percent. Fun fact, we gotta melt it into your brain before we're, we're done playing this game. But Say that again? That uh, rage starts at what, 50%? No, rage starts from 35 to 150. 35 to 150. Yeah, yeah. it's the same in the uh, game according to sources. Ooh, very nice. You see Ralphie kind of like, huh? That was weird. It's like, oh. Uh, uh, bad dog. Oh. <laughs> Good dog. All right, so we got rid of Lilat, and we're going to <coughs> Smashville. We were on town game one, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I dig, I dig the counter pick. Smaller stage, smaller glass zones horizontally. So. Yeah, I mean, there's also the fact that like uh, Cloud can just do that. He's chilling, bro. Look at that. <laughs> like BB has to catch him. It's just like sick, yeah. sick, go. Yeah, it's over, Anakin. I had the high ground. <laughs> Yeah, see, like... Yep. <laughs> this is the thing uh, about it. Yeah. It's like, how do I want to fight him? He's blue, so I should be blue. <laughs> That's how it works. Flawless. Lucario in some, like, backwards way could be, like, related to, like, Red 13 or something like that. <laughs> Where, where's, where's my Final Fantasy cross Pokemon fan fiction? Oh, oh, you mean Red Sheep. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's a Chinese lion. <laughs> Something uh, like that. Like, yeah. <laughs> I've actually never played Final Fantasy VII, so I have no uh, idea. Neither have I. <laughs> we don't play video games. We play Super Smash Brothers. It's actually, yeah, we're not gamers. We're Smashers. Hit it right. Nice read on the air dodge right there. Another, uh, you know, uh, poor, poorly timed air dodge on the part of Ralphie. Vivi, one game away or one stock away from uh, advancing on the winner's semifinals. Yeah, Vivi actually doing really well. Like he's been kind of in the driver's seat the entire time. I, once he brought back that lead, 
uh, in the first game. He's kind of just like not let go of it. Yeah, he's looking like super crisp and uh, he's not looking too like discouraged right now. Because I know it's like just playing against a DLC main in general is very tilting. But Ralphie's still giving him the work though, so he's definitely not out of the woods by any means. I think ideally he'd like to take the stock without having to use limit, but that was. I mean, recovery. right now when you, I, I I kind of uh, like the fact that Ralphie's like not overextending because he's like he has he knows where he can take control of the game, and he's just like let me just keep to the game plan. It's fine. I yep. don't have to like overextend. I know I'm losing, but if I keep this up, I won't be losing for much longer. <laughs> you know. And here we are back to an even game, and he never had to spend that limit. Yep, just playing it super reserved, close to the vest. Knowing that he can probably net that kill much early. You'll have a much easier hill to climb uh, with limit than he would without it. Again, just going right back to work here and just sees the lead. Back to work, he's just clocking in. <laughs> oh, no. What do you do, man? Like, this advantage for Lucario in this matchup is just so bad. I mean, oh, jeez. <laughs> <coughs> oh, but just like that, things are essentially even. Nice tech on the spike right there from Vivi. Thoroughly spooked, though. Oh, yeah. There's like moderate amount, moderate amount of spooks going on right now. Down tilting the wrong way, but that was all according to plan. <laughs> all according to Keikaku. Oh. oh. Bum, 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 bum. Sweet. I agree, Cloud. Whoa. What? Don't know yes. what the hell you said, but I agree with I you. I concur. Do you guys sell some drinks here by any chance? Huh? Do you guys sell some drinks here? Uh, yeah. You want me to get your water? Uh, something or with, yeah. Red Bull? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I'll take both. <laughs> Jesus, just give me, like, all of it. <laughs> we're actually, we're actually going to get a mini fridge in the stream room. Oh, my God. Dude, a mini fridge is the one thing I've aspired to get since I've had money in, like, a oh, lot yeah, of years. Oh, yeah, 100%. Three bucks enough. Like I, I, my mom was refused to let me buy a mini fridge, like, <laughs> she, like because she knows I'll never come out of my room if I get one. All right. Oh, what do we have here? I don't know what that means, but here we go. That's Charizard. All right, so Vivi opting to switch to Charizard here. Did not know he played anybody else other than Lucario, so we'll see how this ends up working out for him. Right now, it's not looking too good. I, I think this matchup's okay for Charizard, just because if he plays his cards right, he's able to, you know, knock Cloud, uh, yeah, keep Cloud at disadvantage and kill him relatively early. But right now, it's not looking too good. Oof! There we go. Down throw, air dodge read to the back there, and we'll be seeing you. Good use of the blade beam right there for, for Ralphie, covering himself on the ledge. I'm back. Where Where's his stock? Uh, he lost it in the war. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. I was actually talking about this matchup yesterday because Jackal played Charizard against one of our local cloud mains. Yeah, I, uh, it was versus Christmas? Yes. Okay, um, yeah. I watched. I was watching. Yeah. I don't think this matchup's awful for Charizard. I don't think it's that great either because he can well, do stuff like that. Yeah, he, he's dead now. Yay. <laughs> Nourishment. I mean, yeah. Yeah, no, no, no. This matchup's, like, not awful. It's definitely, like, you're definitely relying on the fact that your opponent might not know what to do on the other side of it if you're the cloud main. I think I think it like boils down to like Charizard's a heavy boy, right? So he can afford he can afford to take a few hits. Yep. And like he has some pretty horizontal hitting moves. And for the horizontally impaired like Cloud, you know, that can actually be pretty pretty potent, you know. You have mm -hmm. you have down tilt, you have F tilt, you have uh, Forward air, forward, yeah, forward tilt, yeah, yeah, those. Yeah, there we go. See, right on cue. Good job. Oh, and down smash, like that sends you hella sideways, and like that's literally. Oh, goodbye. I'm sorry. And it's out of here. Bye bye. All right, so a valiant effort on the part of VV, but the counter pick just not working out in his favor right there. It's too strong. Yep. So yeah, take a look at that, and we out of there. <laughs>
I, res I applaud him for going through with the uh, the punishing kill right there. I should have. What I should have done was to disrespectfully just change the camera immediately, <laughs> and just been like, yeah, yeah, it's over.